Hello everyone, you're watching Inside Expect and with me today I have uh, Richard and Jonathan and uh, we're gonna look ahead of the final matches of Group A and Group B and first of all, Jonathan, Group A. Right, um, the different scenarios are relatively complicated. On a way they're very straightforward. If Uruguay and Mexico draw, Uruguay will finish top and Mexico will finish second. That's the easy bit. So obviously the draw price is very low. If South Africa were to beat France and Uruguay beat Mexico, Uruguay would finish top and Mexico or South Africa would finish second and it would go down to goal difference. Getting more complicated now, if South Africa were to beat France and Mexico beat Uruguay, Mexico would finish top and Uruguay or South Africa would finish second again, that would go down to goal difference. If France were to beat South Africa and Mexico were to beat Uruguay, Mexico would finish top and Uruguay or France would finish second and again that second place would go down to goal difference. If France beat South Africa and Uruguay beat Mexico, Uruguay finished top and Mexico or France will finish second again it goes down to goal difference. I am so confused, I'm just going to enjoy these matches. I'm going to hand over to Richie, he's going to tell you what's actually going to happen. <laughs> I mean, obviously, as soon as Mexico were leading against France, the odds just dropped straight away on the Mexico-Uruguay draw. Yeah. Are they going to play out a draw? I mean, if they play out a draw, then Mexico are lumped with, it looks like, they're going to be playing Argentina in the next round. Yeah. They don't want that. No. Now, there's not much between these teams, Mexico and Uruguay, and Mexico, at the moment, they're about 385. Now, on two even sides, yeah. okay, so that's 20 minutes and they're drawing and something's happening in the france South Africa game, mm -hmm. then they're going to shut up. You know, better safe than sorry. But in the meantime, I think Mexico and Uruguay are going to be going for this. And two insides, 385 on Mexico. They look nice, don't they? Yeah. They look yeah. nice against France. Yeah. And also 430 on, on Uruguay. And 430. I mean, if you if it, you bank Uruguay or Mexico, yeah. you could not fault it. But I, I'm I'm going for Mexico here. Vela might it might be missing. He's going in due. But Hernandez, the, the new United guy, he'll step in. Yeah. And I think they've, they've got enough to beat uh, Uruguay. And yeah. 385 looks a nice price. France, South Africa, I mean, it's disarray there. Yeah. You know, they walked out of training. And South Africa, obviously, still playing for pride, aren't they? Yeah. I don't know how it will affect France, whether the team come together, you know, forget about the management. Mm -hmm. Us boys are going to go out and do it. Very tough game to call. Yeah. Very tough. That's obviously. Right. Um, and it's just as complicated in Group B. In fact, it's unbelievably complicated. The, in, the, in, the only interesting and straightforward thing is Argentina will finish top if they just get a draw against Greece. Everything else in that is absolutely up for grabs, Richie. Yeah. Yeah. I can't even begin to go through these. They're just you're like absolutely lost in it all. Yeah. But looking at it, I mean, for example, Nigeria, it's an absolute must-win game for them. They have to win. Yeah, they have to win and they have to hope that Argentina yeah. do the business against Greece. Argentina should beat Greece. I don't think Greece have shown enough. Yes. Um, Do you think Argentina might rest some key players? For I think they will. I think Melito will get a shake from the start. Yeah, and Aguera, right. he, yeah. he should come on. Um, but of know, course the Greeks will have to play a little bit more uh, attractive and go yeah. up front. I mean, but the, the interesting thing, a draw and Greece could qualify. Yes. yes. If Greece win, they could still go out, yeah. depending on the other game. So, you know, they're going to take and easy and, and, in the, and in the Nigeria-South Korea game, will the Koreans go for a draw and just hope that Argentina beat Greece? Because no. that again is a possibility, they will go through with that scenario. But I don't think it's in the South Korean style, I mean when you saw them against Greece, very attacking team, look, yeah. look very attractive yeah. and I don't think it's their style to no, uh, sit no. back. And I don't think, you know, at this stage you don't want to be taking any risks, yeah. I think they'll go for it. But also Nigeria will go for it, Nigeria yeah. one will win yeah. and Argentina win, Two then Nigeria, Nigeria. is sneaking yeah via the back door. Exactly. So uh, I think what we can safely say is about 75 minutes on the clock in these games, there's going to be an awful lot of instructions coming from the There'll be a few walkie the, the crowd, there'll be there. misinformation, yeah. all sorts of things, it's going to be amazing. Uh, one thing here, Nigeria were even money to win the game against South Korea before the tournament started, yeah. now they're 2.8. Yeah. You know, that silly sending off but the, you know, against Greece, but yeah. You know, they're more than capable. So, and yeah. I, I fancy 2.8, I think, again, that's an overreaction. So, Richard, who do you question. think will go through? Head on the line, who do you think will go through? Uh, I think Mexico will go through with Uruguay. Yeah. I think Mexico will win, but there won't be enough goal difference from the France-South uh, France, Africa. Right. And I think Argentina will go through. All right, 
I'm going to go for Nigeria. Right. To get through by the back door with yeah. Argentina. Yeah. Well, 2 8 on Nigeria to beat South Korea and 163 on Argentina to beat Greece. That's the. Yeah, awesome 163. Thing. There'll be some takers on that, won't there? Exactly. Uh, anything else from Group B? No, I think we're pretty much done there. We're just looking forward to it. We're going to have these sheets in front. I'm going to have all these sheets in front of me. And front of the it's going to be mate. Then. We're going to love every minute of it. Absolutely wonderful. That's it for us from at Insect Expect. Yep. Yeah. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Bye. Bye.